Well, tonight, more than a third of people who have applied for unemployment benefits in Alabama still haven't received a dime. NBC 15's Andrea Ramey live now with the latest numbers from the Labor Department. Andrea? Yeah, Greg, things are improving, just not fast enough for those who haven't received uh, those benefits. Just five days ago, the state reporting that it had paid out 40% of people filing COVID-19 claims. Today, that has increased now to 64% of claims being paid with more than $304 million paid out in unemployment benefits. But that's still leaving behind thousands and thousands of people in Alabama in need. The state says it's making some updates to improve response. Tomorrow it says there will be improvements uh, with being able to upload documents from your smartphone, which will speed up the process. State Senator Chris Elliott says there's still a lot of room for improvement and serious lessons learned on how to get better. I know one thing that they're doing right now is sending out all these initial denial letters. If somebody wasn't qualified from unemployment under the old you know, law, then maybe they would be under the new law. Well, that means about half of your, um, your applicants are getting a denial letter, and it's scaring the heck out of them, and it's doing that for no reason. Elliot fears that some people who really need these benefits will never receive them. Now to see some of the improvements that the later Labor Department has made, head to our website, mynbc15.com. Just click on this story. Reporting live tonight in Mobile, Andrea Ramey, NBC 15 News.